And welcome back, folks. Welcome back to Let's Play Part Planet of Death. Welcome to the last episode of this Let's Play. Let us do the final race. Let us for this final race. Not, in fact, do a new track. Let us, in fact, do the very first track, Beltane. Let us, okay, let us not use these settings, which were a bit too daring. Let us maybe, um, put a little bit more into grip and handling. Let us now try to to actually win this race. Let us try to compete in this race on hard difficulty. And let us show what we have learned or what we didn't. Yeah, that was a mistake. And they are quite, quite aggressive, as you can see, or at least some of them. Some of these races, uh, drivers are extremely aggressive. And our car is already getting damaged. Let us try to avoid them as much as possible. Okay, there's the box stop. We'll try to avoid the box stop if possible. Okay, we are not quite. Okay, let us try to make him ramp into something. I think that worked. Uh, okay, now we lost two positions. We need to go to the box stop. Uh, hmm. We very much need to go to the box stop. Let us hope we can make them jump when we did. Okay. <sighs> Miraculously, somehow we are still on the fifth place. Uh, let us try to keep that position. Yeah, if your car is damaged, not only does the speed decrease, but also the handling is very, very different. The car feels what we like, um, like a shopping cart right now. That's how it, uh, that, that's how it feels right now. Okay, we need to go to the box stop. I'm afraid it will not be so... Okay, well actually it was quite um, helpful. Lost one position however, and someone has lost another position. Okay, let us try to make him ram in to something. Okay, that worked. Uh, so back on the fifth spot, and he's right on our tail. I think this time we could actually make the jump. Let us cross our fingers and we made it. Yeah, that's one way in which you can actually go to the box stop without losing time. That's possible provided that you're caught. That's possible provided Provided, 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 provided your car is fast enough. And that was just stupid what I just did. Anyway, we are somehow still on the fifth place, which is surprising. But I'm not going to complain. Yeah, that's the last. The last episode, the last 
episode of this let's play. Kind of sad that um, it's ending, but on the other hand, I think this is a good, good time to end. We've seen the championship. We've seen the story. Um, when, I've, when I will have read out to you the last text log, you will know the complete story of this game. Ugh. I lost the position there. We will finally learn why we are actually in this race. Because until now there's no... We shouldn't really be in this race. We are after all... Member of the police force. Even though there's not much to police here anymore. We shouldn't be in this race. We should be trying to stop these people. Not compete with them. And I think we'll find out why we are in this race right now. So after I I read out this last text log, and then we shall end this let's play. D die minus one. Derek stealths John. Diane. Those thieves. I knew I wouldn't be able to lock up all of them successfully all by myself. I think I got a little cocky when I caught Manzano. I let my guard down and it seems they have the trump card now. They stole my single seat at Stardust. My only way of I.O. My guess is that they snuck through the gate in the middle of the night with a flatbed truck and drove it away. I definitely would have heard them if they had started their engines on the Stardust. After throwing Manzano around a bit, he told me where they most likely hid my Stardust. I was just gathering my things when all of a sudden I heard the door buzz. Who else was still on this planet other than them? When the door opened, there they were, the entire gang. They stood there, all ten, none were armed. And they didn't even look mean, necessarily. I must say I was pretty perplexed. Why would these guys be ringing my door? My first thought was that they had gone completely insane until one of them handed me a folded note and waited for me to read it. As I unfolded it, I realized it was a computer data sheet, most likely stolen from the Solnet, announcing that PART was going to resume its activity in less than three weeks. It appears that the scientist researching PART found the factor that determines PART's phases. It has something to do with the position of Jupiter and Io in their orbits. I must admit the technical explanation was way over my head. But I did understand that we had three weeks from the date of the report until the end of Io. Unfortunately, the report was stated a week ago, which means by Dear bosses have decided to let me be the guinea pig down here. I tried to hide my surprise as best as I could when I told them that I was full, fully aware of the notification, but I am sure it was written all over my face. They had captured the only way of this confounded planet. The Stardust is the only vehicle left on Io with enough power to make it to Joey Central. It's my Stardust. I began to wonder if they were just going to leave me here when one of the ten began speaking in a solemn voice. We all understand that only one person is going to be able to leave this planet alive. We all enjoy speed and love the thrill of competition. We have decided to give the Stardust to the winner of a series of races. The rules are simple. The best driver wins the right to leave this corroded planet by piloting the Stardust to Joby Central. You have proven that you are a great driver and are invited to join us. You must realize that if you do not join, you will die. And without another word, they all turned and walked away, leaving me standing with the door and my mouth wide open. 
Do you understand the irony of the situation? The winner gets my Stardust. And I have to fight to get it back. It seems I have no other choice though. Now it's the race against part. Survival of the fastest. Wish me luck, Diane. I'll need anything I can get. End of journal entry. And now we finally learned why we are in this race. We are in this race to get back our Stardust. To get off this planet and we've seen in the end cutscene what happens to this planet. So we've now learned about the story. Um, yeah, I've shown you the the um, the championship. Over uh, all in all, I think it was a pretty pretty enjoyable experience for me. It was a nice change of pace from my from the games that I normally play. I will probably in the future do another racing game, maybe even port. Maybe I will try to do this um, championship on hard. Well, we see. Anyway, I hope you liked this let's play, and of course, I hope you liked this game. Until next time, folks, until um, then.